Hi, my name's Cameron. Oh. Are we are we doing a bit? Huh? Hi, my name's Cameron Carlson with AnimeLocation.tv. I'm here at MetsuriCon 2014 with Mr. Ian Sinclair. Yep. <laughs> so it's been only a few short months since uh, we got the time to cha chat with you. It was at OhioCon 2014. How have you been? I've been good. <laughs> been doing pretty good, huh? We. Fun, 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 fun fans coming through. Space Dandy continues to be a beast in the ratings with fans. It's got now season two going along with the uh, second uh, second part of the first season, so I counted season two. And uh, going forward, how's the rest of the cast been reacting to that awesome show being able to be broadcast both here in America and Japan? They really like it. It's, it's been fun. It's been pretty good for you, huh? So we love talking to you about food, as we can see as in the in the shot here, and you've because you took on the role of Toriko. Uh, what culinary treats have you had recently? Uh, you want fans to know about in your many travels across the world. I'm I'm eating uh, potato chips. Um, sometimes they have chili here, and that's really fun and good. It's got good chili. I think it's called Skyline Chili. I think it's pretty popular around here in Ohio. Cool. <laughs> All righty then. So now we know you're a huge comic book fan. And Comic-Con 2014 just took place. And uh, is there anything you um, took place? And it had some big news come out from it. What was your favorite piece of news you heard about the industry that you would love to talk about with fans? Because I, I know you are a comic book nerd like the rest of us. I, li I like comic books. I'm wearing my Magneto is right shirt. <laughs> We like Magneto as well. He was right. He was right. <laughs> you're always right. I love you so much. <laughs> now, we know you're a fan of old school anime. Recently, the Dragon Ball Z Battle of the Gods movie just came out in theaters. How do you feel about the project? And what, was it, what does it say about the anime industry and the anime fans? How they uh, reacted to it? And the fact that it has a really big cultural impact on fans and everything. You're just creeping me out now. I like that movie. Um, I'm stronger than everybody now. So, Vegeta, suck it. Can you do the one minute long power screams as it was a proof that you were a voice actor back in the old Funimation days? Yes, I can. Because <laughs> Mike McFarlane gave us those tips about that. So, uh, One Piece is yet again, it's so much fun, and you got to play the role of Brooke. How is it going about that project, and how are fans reacting to it? Because uh, I know that you were loving the fact that you got to play Brooke. He also has a cool violin, and his character is just crazy awesome. So how is it for fans to react to him, especially because he has he's part of a movie? Brooke's a lot of fun. He's got a violin. <clears throat> Alrighty. Now, you have some challenging projects such as Rin and Duke Nukem. How would you say you approach some of those roles, especially considering the nature of them? How would you, how do you approach them? Because, um, you know, the graphic nature of them and on top of the maturity of them. So, obviously some fans shouldn't watch them at a certain age yet. So how do you approach those, those projects, especially Rin? There's a microphone and, and then you get, you got, you got two, two screens. And one of them has the video, and the other one has um, script. <laughs> and I and I read the script for the video. All righty. Now, are there any upcoming projects you want fans to desperately know about so they can check them out? Watch Space Dandy. Space Dandy all the way. Yes. Alrighty, and anyway, we can obviously keep up with you. I know I and I, Ian tweeting is your hashtag, I believe, on Twitter, and uh, I know you have a Facebook page for your fans. Uh, that's not run by you; it's run by another fan. Uh, any other way fans can keep up with you? Watch Space Dandy. I'm I'm on. I I play Space Dandy in that. Um, it's on Cartoon Network. It's on Toonami on late night, and it's at I believe 12 o'clock every night. That's true. Alrighty, is there a final message you want to get out to all your wonderful fans out there? <laughs> you should probably watch Space Dandy. It's really good. 
All righty. Thanks so much, Ian, for coming and talking with us. Thank you so much as always. Ian Sinclair, everyone. Thank you so much.